overall, Highland matched everything that we needed. Something that wasn't so far away where it would take a vacation to go visit the dog and the, the organization. The people were so friendly and seemed genuinely concerned about Charlotte and her needs and if they can appropriately match Charlotte's needs with a dog so it's not like they're just selling us a dog. And then the price was right in line with what we have researched as a fair price for a service dog. I feel like riders training is, is top notch. I mean, the touch and the lay and the down, um, the emergency down, I mean, those are things that we definitely need and, and those were great. And on top of everything else, I mean, just the general obedience training and all that kind of stuff is, is really, I mean, he, he's, he's great, he's awesome. One thing I'm looking forward to is Charlotte having that companion. Um, Charlotte's a very social person and sometimes because of her speech delay and some of her, her, her inabilities to read social situations, Ryder is going to be um, a big help in kind of bridging that gap between another child and Charlotte. I think, you know, Ryder will become part of the family. So, I mean, Ryder is going to be part of the family. I think he'll help Charlotte um, just with those, those tense moments she has of you can kind of see it with a kid with autism that they're going to start going over the edge and I think Ryder will always be that person or place or family member she can rely on to, uh, to help calm her down to help to, to, so she doesn't lose her temper and things like that.